Let's talk about this. Go ahead and bring up the screen, please. That's right, Joe Go Cruise Crazy Five is happening January 31st through February 8th, 2015. It's a go. This is an eight-night cruise. You spoke, we listened. Uh, it is going to once again be on this very ship, the Independence of the Seas. And the itinerary is, is going to once again be sailing from Fort Lauderdale to St. Martin, St. Kitts, Puerto Rico, and the Lavani Private uh, Resort in Haiti. Let's talk prices. All of these prices you see will be per person based on double occupancy. Storm? All in pricing just like this year, so no hidden costs. Uh, booze not included, but you seem to do just fine with that. <laughs> so it's got all your taxes and fees, your gratuities, everything. We won't bother reading these numbers, we'll just let you look at them. So they are higher, mostly because it is an eight-night cruise. That said, even at these prices, they're actually only a little bit more than Joko 3 was. And on a per... per that was a seven-night cruise. Seven-night cruise. Whole extra day. And on a per-night basis, this is actually less expensive, expensive than either. And we'll have more details later. But just so you know what you're getting into. This is the important part. Discounts for you people. All returning sea monkeys who have been on any Joko cruise crazy from this one back to one receive $35 per berth. That goes for all the berths in the cabin, even if some of, anyone in the cabin who is not a returning monkey. Everyone who books by May 23rd will receive a $75 per berth discount. And these are, of course, stackable. <laughs> and this is brand new for this year. RCI is providing our group with a $100 per cabin room credit on Joko Cruise Crazy 5. Here's the catch. You have to you have to book while here on Joko Cruise Crazy 4. Uh, we'll get to more on that in a second. But that basically breaks down to if you uh, apply all of these discounts in a double occupancy room, that's $160 per person discount, which is nothing to sneeze at. I don't know what's a metaphor for that. Sneezing works for most things. Sneezing, yeah. <laughs> Let's keep talking more about illness while stuck on a cruise ship. That's good. Um, talking about uh, onboard booking. The only time period for people to book before the whole rest of the general public does is for you people here on this ship, which we are now calling Firsties Booking. And that's a great sneezing benefit. <laughs> Uh, we're going to, also, if you book while on board here, you will have first crack before anybody else at room selection. This year, the booking engine is going to allow you to select your own cabin number. It'll be like a map and everything. I know. Maps. <laughs> so there's going to be a booking form distributed with tonight's Sea Monkey that will arrive uh, late this evening in all of your staterooms. Uh, it's a very simple form. There's all sorts of information on it. The basics are you will fill out your name, your cabin, your current cabin number, your birth date, your preferred cabin type, interior, exterior, balcony, suite. Now that, that will not guarantee you will be able to get that cabin type. We, we don't know exactly what kind of inventory we will have access to and some categories are limited, but it will help us uh, be able to know which cabin types we should at least ask for. And it's not binding, you can always change your mind later. As, we, as Storm says, it's mainly to help us get an idea of the distribution. Uh, and there is a, a deposit due, which can be billed to your uh, room account. But if you prefer to put it on a different credit card, you can, on that form, list what credit card you want this deposit to be billed to. But for those who, uh, who pre-booked last year, there's going to be no longer standing around an iPad waiting for Square to communicate with a satellite somewhere. No more. You can do it straight to your room accounts. Uh, the deposit, if you want to book on board, is $250 per cabin. That's not per person. That's just per cabin. And that's what would get billed to your account or that alternate credit card. Uh, again, this gives you first crack on room selection when that opens up. Uh, the deadline to turn in that form here on the ship will be 9 p.m. on Thursday, day 5. That's just before 
the uh, Mustache Formal. Um, and there are several places where you can uh, drop that off. There will be, uh, there's an info desk, as you all know, outside the conference center, down on deck two, which is manned by sea monkeys. You can drop that off there um, when it is manned by a sea monkey, and they can print you an immediate receipt, if you like, so that you have evidence that you did this and that you took your money. Uh, alternately, uh, you can, if you don't want to wait for a receipt, you can put it in the sealed box that we have, and we'll be e uh, emailing, I'm sorry, dropping off a receipt at your cabin every night or the next night at the latest. Uh, alternately, if there's no one there at the uh, desk and you want to hand your form into someone, especially if you've written your credit card number on, you can just hand it to any helper monkey and they will get it to us. Uh, this is the deposit schedule. Uh, this week, you would be charged 250 for the cabin. And then, uh, during the first D's cabin selection, when that opens up, and again, that's just to you people, which currently is scheduled for April 15th, there'll be another $250 per birth due. Uh, another $250, uh, May 29th, $325 per birth, October 2nd, and then your remaining balance, November 10th. This is roughly comparable to the... Almost the same as it was this year. Uh, and the cancellation policy, because I see you all saying, I don't want to plunk down $250, I don't know what my schedule is going to be yet. Uh, this deposit, this $250 per cabin deposit, is fully refundable for any reason or no reason all the way through May 23rd, 2014. So if you're not sure, uh, you still can take the chance and, and you don't have to give up any... You can lock in your discounts now. Exactly. So that is the basics of Joko Cruise Crazy 5. Again, there will be a lot more complete information in the booking form that comes with your Sea Monkey. But we hope to see you all this time, well, minus a month, next year. So I think that's about as much a, a naked commercialism as we need yeah. tonight. Except for the fact that I can't wait for Joko Cruise Crazy 6 when he grows his sixth finger on that hair. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my name is Inigo Montoya. <laughs> he killed my father.